Well, that just made it dated. Hey guys, welcome back to Minecraft, part 23. Now, for today's episode, we're actually going to be creating a new world, and this is mainly due to the fact that, if you didn't remember from the last episode, the game just broke. It literally broke, and I lost all of my stuff in the end. So instead, what I'm doing is just restarting the world completely because I don't want to cheat at the Ender Dragon, even though I did technically cheat to get the Eye of Enders, but, you know, who cares? So we are just going to create world, and it's going to be survival and normal, and... Yeah, I think most of the stuff is just already set. Now, there's definitely going to be something different about this world, and you might actually tell by the name, we are going to be doing what is known as the Hermit Challenge. Stella? Stella! Hello? Hello? Get away from the radon door. But if you don't know, the Hermit Challenge is basically where you have to collect as many stuff in five days, and this counts the nights, and once those five days and nights are over, you basically can't go on the surface. You have to stay underground. So we have to be really quick in the daytime to get all my to get all the resources, and we can't sleep the nights. Otherwise, we are just skipping a whole nother day technically. So we don't want to do that. So yeah, this is going to be something fun. And credit to Diamond Stingray for giving me the idea. I will give her credit on that. But yeah, anyways, let's just get right into it. Okay, so we are in. So let's actually open up the map. Okay, nice. Good thing we actually have a marker. All right. So we actually have to collect wood. Let's just... We, we gotta go fast. <gasps> There's a fox. Hey, fox oh boy. That means there must be sweet berries nearby. All right. Let's follow the fox -o. Come on. You just led us to a swamp. Okay, enough fooling around. We actually have to make our first crafting table, so we just gotta go as quickly as possible. All right, there we go. So let's uh, create a wooden axe. I just had a stroke there. Um, yeah, we got, wow, we got 64 sticks, and oh no, I just wasted all my wood. All right, so we got some more wood, so now we can actually make some more tools. This time, do not spend it all on sticks. So let's make a couple pickaxes and an axe definitely we also got to make a sword to protect us from the night but let's just go get stone as quickly as possible i think there's stone back this way okay so we found this little stone hill so i'm just gonna mine stone so we can get stone tools as quickly as possible the biggest trouble of this is probably going to be getting food so i'm gonna have to get that very quickly all right there's a cow right here come on all right thank you now, one thing we will need is a furnace as well, so we also have to find coal if we want to cook up the meat, so I'm going to have to kill a lot of animals. Alright, just found some coal. Let's mine it. Alright, come on. Come on. It's almost night. I have a feeling. Sweet berries. Yes, okay. So we actually found some sweet berries. I'm going to be taking those, so we could use those as food for now, so hopefully we can find something else. So, one thing I think I need to do is craft a furnace, because we really need a furnace to cook the meat. So I'm definitely gonna make a furnace, but I'm also not trying to do that. I'm trying to, one thing I wanna do is make, uh, oh, that's how you make a smoker, okay. So I could try and actually get that, so that way we can actually make a smoker. Okay, so it's starting to become night, so now let's just cook the meat because we need we need food and we definitely need light but i think if you actually chop down wood like as the log forms you can actually get the blast for, or the smoker i think i have no idea let me let me see all right come on now let's let's just take that out and let's mine this so now let's actually see if we can make the smoker. We can, okay, that's good. So the smoker should cook food a lot quicker, but we just gotta get out of here. We, we just gotta run. <gasps> oh my God! Oh, I did not hear that at all. All right, sugar cane, that's good. Cause then we can farm that. And pumpkins as well, that's actually really good. If it, okay, there we go. Don't know why I did that. Okay, let's just kill these cows for food. 
Now, all right, so now we can actually cook them in the smoker. So that's good. Okay, so let's just cook the raw beef in the smoker and we should get steak, okay. So that should be good. Okay, so I didn't really do that much. It's all of a sudden starting to become night two, I think, because day two is now ending. So night two is now starting. So that's just great. Whoa, baby zombie! Oh my god, I did not know that was a th Oh my god, I did not see the baby zombie. What is that, by the way? Okay. Good thing it's stuck in a tree. Okay, come on. This thing is stuck in the tree. Oh shoot! No, 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 it came out. No. Oh my god. I thought it was one hit there for a second. Holy crap. Um... Can I eat, please? Uh, I'm probably gonna die. Alright, there's a water... Oh shoot, the witch. There's water right here, so... Oh my god, he's right there, he's right there, he's right there! Oh, no, no! Oh shoot. Alright, yes, yes, alright, yes! Hopefully there's no drowned. Whoa! Oh, ee, 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 ee. The stupid witch. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. There was a village right near spawn. And I decided to go the other way. Hey, buddy. I, I legit went the opposite direction of this village. Well, at least we can now have food, so that's great. So food's not a problem. All we need is just a couple of stuff, I guess. So, yeah, I think we're good to go now with the village. That's great. Okay, so usually these guys have great loot. So, oh, okay, I was going to say, I'm like, how is there no loot? So that's good. Apple and bread. All right. Nice. I'm definitely going to keep that. Ooh, iron armor off the bat. Okay. That's some good stuff right there. Okay, so now this is the third day. So it's becoming the third day already. So that's not really that great because... We were doing super well until we died because it was actually pretty good. Oh yeah, okay, so I think the thing we need now the most is probably sugarcane because we need to farm that. But that's really it. I think if we get sugarcane and like if we get enough, we could easily just probably speed the process up by actually skipping the nights. Okay, so that is good. We found another village, okay. So, hopefully, if they actually do have wheat, well, let's check. Okay, so it looks like they do have hay bales. So, yes, we can actually grow wheat and actually live off bread. Okay, this is perfect. This is going really well so far. So, yeah, honestly, I think we're probably ready, except I forgot. We need sugar cane. Okay, so it's day four. Now, all we need is sugar cane because we need more paper... So that way we can sort of make a map. Oh my god, we actually found a, another village. And look at all the sugar cane right there. Okay, nice. So hopefully this is actually a wheat village. Because that would be nice. I want my bread. They are a carrot farm. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, so this is the final day. So I don't know where to actually set up camp. I want to like do it in a mine shaft, but... I don't know where Mineshaft is. No way. And it's another village. Okay. Um, well, that's... Wow. We've been just finding villages all over the place. Holy crap. So it looks like it's a water village. Okay. Just doesn't seem like much, I guess. Unless... Oh, wait, no. We've already... We've came full circle. So it must be a sign to dig. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna dig down and yeah, I think it's time to just dig down, I guess, in, you know, just mole time. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna mine out a little outline. Okay, so now it's actually time to block the hole. Okay, so let's just put some torches down. So we mobs don't spawn in. Okay, good. So now I think what I'm actually going to do is just place all of my items and stuff and then also put most of this in the chest. 
because I have a lot of items. And I actually might make a large chest instead, because we can make a chest. So I'm just gonna plop most of the stuff in here, except for the things I can place, because we just need a clear inventory. Okay, so it looks like we got a nice hidey hole for now. I don't know how I'm gonna grow crops down here. I guess I could use the dirt and place it all down on the ground. But, uh, yeah, this will end this episode. This episode was mainly just getting the materials and going through all five days. And, yeah, I guess we did that. So next episode will actually be constructing my house in the hidey hole. And, uh, yeah, anyways, guys, I'm Julie Lubuck, and you're just going to be sure. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!